Hi everybody, so today I'm going to be showing you how to make a wind anemometer. An anemometer is a device that can measure wind speed based on the number of times it spins outside. So first the materials you'll need are um, a piece of thick cardboard, a pen, a ruler, four paper cups, a thumbtack, something that you can cut with, like a um, scissors or a knife, um, a stapler, a pencil, modeling clay, or something similar like Play-Doh. Um, alternatively, if you don't have clay at home, you can use a plastic water bottle with some dirt and water inside. So first, you are going to cut the cardboard into two strips, each one one and a half inches wide and 12 inches long. Next, arrange the two strips in the shape of a cross. Staple them together. Attach one paper cup to each of the four ends of the cross. You can decorate the cups first um, to make your anemometer more personal and special to you. Make sure that the cups are all facing the same direction. Take your pencil and put it on top of the modeling clay so that the eraser side is sticking straight up. Then put the thumbtack through the middle of the cross and into the eraser of the pencil. Alternatively, if you're using the water bottle, put some dirt and water into the bottle and then stick your pencil inside. Then, just like with the clay, Put the thumbtack into the cross and then on top of the pencil. For the last step, go outside and test your new meter out. You may need to attach tape to the modeling clay or bottle to better adhere it to the surface. Then put a timer on for one minute and count the number of times the anemometer spins. Divide that number by 10 and that is approximately the wind speed per hour in your area. And that's it! Thank you to everybody who joined me today in making this anemometer. Um, I hope you found this project fun. Um, stay safe guys and enjoy your summers. <laughs>